The Lebanese army is carrying out mop-up operations in the southern city of Sidon following fierce clashes with the armed followers of the Kfiri cleric, Sheikh Ahmed al-Asir. Reports coming out of Lebanon suggest the army is now in full control of the southern city of Sidon. They are now searching for Sheikh Asir. Lebanese security forces moving residents of Sidon to safer places. Panic spread across the southern Lebanese city after armed followers of Sheikh Ahmed al-Asir attacked a security checkpoint in the city, 40 kilometers south of the capital, Beirut. It doesn't seem that this all happened randomly. Uh, the attack against the Lebanese army, according to the Lebanese army command, uh, the, uh, the statement that they issued, they clearly said that the, the army had, did not provoke anyone, that they merely asked for a simple check which is in their authority. So uh, apparently al was trying to uh, pick a fight with the Lebanese uh, military institution, but it backfired on him because uh, as we can see, uh, the entire region he had, the security zone he had worked so hard on establishing, has now fallen uh, under, uh, the, uh, the, uh, under the authority of the Lebanese army and the Lebanese military institution. Asir is a Takfiri cleric who has openly supported foreign-backed insurgents in Syria. Asir had reportedly pledged retaliation following the Syrian army's victory in the strategic city of Qusayr, backed by Hezbollah. Sidon was turned into a battle zone on Monday as the military fought heavily armed followers of the extremist cleric holed up in a mosque. The army is now in full control of the city. Lebanese troops have seized control of Asir's headquarters following two days of clashes with the loyalists of the Takfiri cleric. Lebanese soldiers have also seized a large cache of weapons, including rocket launchers and machine guns at its headquarters. The deadly clashes in Sidon are seen as yet another stark reminder of how the violence in Syria is destabilizing life in neighboring countries.